Hey Magic Brush friends, I am in the process of making another wreath, wreath, uh, for my front door. It's actually not a wreath at all, it's a really super cute um, baseball decoration that we're making with a home plate, okay? So this is what I'm using to make uh, my next decoration for my front door, I can't wait. Now I wanna show you all of the pieces of this so you guys can duplicate this at home, okay? This home plate came in this base set from Walmart. Super duper cheap, it's like 10 bucks, so easy, okay? It only comes with one home plate, and I'm going to be staining it today because this is what it looks like, you know, when you get them, without the little smudges. But this is what I want it to look like. I want it to look like it's actually been used. I want it to look like it's actually dirty, like it's coming from a field, okay? So the other day, I went ahead and I uh, took some gel stain that I just happen to have in my house. I have the color dark walnut, so that's what I used. You don't have to necessarily use this. I mixed it with a tiny bit of paint thinner, and I just rubbed it on with a torn up sponge, okay? Easy breezy, not a big deal at all. I have um, laid down some plastic on the table because it tends to make friends with the people in my house when I cover the table and whatnot. So um, I'm gonna open this up. Uh, if you guys are without can openers when you're at your home and you need to open up a can of paint, one of my favorite things to use as a can opener is a um, the handle. Um, or either end actually off of a spoon. It's super super easy that way. Okay. Um, I am going to put on a pair of gloves because I did just have my nails done and um, I'm trying. I'm trying to be better at wearing gloves and whatnot to protect my gel nails which there was a story about on the news last night. I'm not happy about what they're saying about gel nails because I'm in love with them. And as a crafter, you should be in love with them too. Okay, so I am going to um, take a sponge. It's just a piece of a sponge, okay? It's not a whole one. And I am just going to turn some paint thinner over on it. I am going to take the lid on my non-gloved hand because I can't find my second glove. And I'm just gonna use some of the stain that's on here, okay? And I'm literally just going to rub this. Where can you see? Right here on top of this um, home plate. Okay, this is gonna go on super easy. And it doesn't have to be perfect because dirty home plates don't look perfect, right? All right, so when I get some on here, I'm just gonna take the other side of this and I'm gonna rub it off, okay? And you can use a rag to keep kind of taking this down to where you want it to go. Now here's the thing, this is rubber and rubber takes stain really, really um, non-consistently, which is why it looks really, really cool, okay? And I've got a little demonstration I'm gonna show you for those of you who are wondering, is it gonna stick? What if it gets wet? Yes, it is. Okay, cool, look at that. All right, so that took me, what, like 30 seconds or something? I'm gonna take my glove off, but yes, I wanted to let you know that I've let this sit a day or two. And I did my spit test on it. Now, if you've watched some of my videos, you will know that I've told you before that your mouth is highly, highly, highly acidic. So if you can't get paint or stain off, um, a lot of times when you're working on a little tiny project like this, with just your spit and your finger, then you're good to go, okay? So I have spit on it, I've rubbed on it, and I've scratched on it, and it is not coming off. So that means it will do just fine on your front door. If you're a little bit, you know, particular about some things, you could always take a spray can of like a polyacrylic and spray over top of this but this is gonna be shiny and home plates aren't shiny and we want it to actually look genuine all right so the next step in this process is I cut a couple of little holes on the top of this with a leather hole punch and I will show you guys the rest of this project in the next couple of days okay until then get yourself some home plates from Walmart and we can do this project together all right bye bye